It was great. Um, this week, this 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 fight was only a four week camp. I got the fight on a four week notice, and uh, I had been doing some training in Colorado, and I just remember it being new and exciting and just really fresh for me. You know, at this point in my career, doing the same thing, you know, for ten years, you know, it's 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 hard to get out of your comfort zone and get some different looks and get excited about some stuff. And I was training with uh, T.J. Dillashaw for his last uh, few weeks of training. Then I took the fight on a four-week notice. So once that happened, and I realized I only had four weeks. I'm like, hey, I'm going to get out of my comfort zone, do a little something different, switch it up. And uh, I've really been enjoying it. So it was nice, man. Um, it was the hardest camp, I would say. Obviously not physically because I've gone hard my whole life, and that's just the way of life for a fighter and, and doing it. But just being out of the comfort zone and the comforts in your own home, not seeing my wife or my dog or my actual house for, you know, the last three, four weeks, you know, being in strange places with different people, not your usual comforts at home. It was awesome, but I also think that helped me grow as a person and a fighter. And, uh, and it was just awesome. Like at this point in my career and in a lot of people's careers, who've been doing it for 10 years and has been ranked number one in the world. There's small little ways to evolve, and it's things like that, getting fresh ideas and new looks, and just keeping it, you know, just just to keep evolving, you know? Kind of easy to get stuck, and the sport's uncomfortable as can be. I mean, you're gonna go in and to a gym and get hit and headlocked, you know? So once you get comfortable in it, it's easy just to be like, oh, this is great. Wake up, hang out with my friends, you know, go to sparring, grapple a little bit, spar a little bit. Um, but I think there's something to be said for getting out of your comfort zone as well. And uh, that's a lot what I did as far as this camp. Spent it um, three weeks in Denver and one week in Albuquerque. And uh, like I said, it was just nice and really reinvigorating, you know, if anything, just to get the new looks and techniques and partners and ideas and just a little of everything. I felt for the first time like I was on a new journey, you know what I mean? Where when I moved and I started fighting, it was cool. It was like, oh, I'm in a new place in Sacramento. You know, you get comfortable there. You get comfortable doing this. And now it was like it was like new again for me, and uh, I think it was exciting, and uh, and and definitely benefited me um, in every way.